Hello, what's going on guys? This is CJ and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to be showing you a new gift cards to friends glitch after patch 1.57. I almost forgot the after patch for a second. 1.57 guys, it is so good. It's more consistent than the arena method. It's basically almost the, the same as the arena method, but it's pretty much the exact same, just a few little things that are different okay guys now before i get into the glitch out um then show you guys how to get glitched i am the founder of this glitch okay guys so if you guys are going to upload this please give me credit i'd really appreciate it all right guys now what you're going to need is of course you're going to need to be able to have access to the car meet you're going to need a nightclub and you're going to need a car in in nightclub b2 and you are uh and you're gonna need to be able to call jail to get a job from him okay guys now what you guys are gonna do once you get to the car meet place um it, i don't really don't know what else to call it once you get to the car meet place um what you guys are gonna do is call up the mechanic go down to nightclub b2 and call any car from out of there okay guys now once you call any car from out of there, just wait for it to spawn. Okay guys, so just waiting for it to spawn right now. All right, so now once it spawns, you're just gonna go and get into the car. And once you get into the car, what you're going to do is you're gonna drive it straight into the car meet place. All right guys? Now, once you get into the car meet place, it should kick you out of your vehicle. Once it kicks you out of your vehicle, you're just going to get straight back in, press triangle, or no, sorry, not triangle, square. So you can get back into it, press square, and then you're going to press X, I believe, to go to the track, and then you're going to enter alone, okay? Now, once you enter alone, what you're going to do once you get in here is you're going to call up, uh, you're going to open your phone and you're going to call up Gerald. Okay, guys. Now, once you call up Gerald, you're going to wait or once you call up, call up Gerald, you're going to request a job. Okay, guys. Now, once you request a job, what you guys are going to do is you're basically going to hover over to the last page and you're going to basically... Um, basically floor the gas and right when your car stops you're gonna press X okay so you're gonna be facing where where normally you would just go and floor the gas and then it would stop you and actually bring you into the car meet area you can either exit or enter the car meet now what you're gonna do is you're gonna hover over the last page you're gonna go and right when it's right when your car stops you're gonna press X you should load in to the job just back out quickly and this is what should happen. You guys sh should see yourself a little bit and then you should be um, invisible. And then once you move a little bit, you should be uh, you should uh, be visible again, okay guys? Now, once that happens, what you guys are gonna have to do, is you guys are gonna have to run around the car meet place to find your car. My car wasn't that far away, but you will have to find your car, okay? Now, once you find your car, what you're gonna do is you're going to press square again and press circle to get out of the car meet, okay? Now, once you do that, you're going to go all the way to your nightclub, all right, guys? Now, once you go all the way to your nightclub, you're just going to pull up to the garage and go into basement level two, okay, guys? I'm just going to have this play on because I'm not going to do any jump cuts because, you know, I don't like doing jump cuts because it makes me feel kind of um, kind of fake, if that makes any sense. Anyways, guys, um, that's basically what I'm doing right now. Okay, now like I said, once you get here, you're going to go straight to the garage. And you're basically going to click X on basement level 2. Okay, guys? And once you click on basement level 2, you're just going to press triangle. And you're going to fall through the map. And then... Depending on where your nightclub is, uh, where my nightclub is, I spawned under where the car, the freeway is, I guess you would say. 
Um, but depending on what nightclub you are doing this with, it'll spawn you in a different place. Now, right here, what you're going to do is is you're wanting to go open the trash menu and kill yourself. Now, the reason why I didn't do it here was because I thought it wasn't like that, okay? Now, right when I started driving and then I started falling through the map, that's when I knew I should have killed myself. Now, as you see, I'm falling through the map and it just killed me. So, once you um, once you spawn, right, right when you press triangle to get out of that screen, to get out of the car to, and then you fall under the map, just open your act interaction menu and kill yourself. It's the best way to do it. Um, and of course, you know, if you're on that highway, maybe maybe you'll be lucky and a pedestrian will just run you over and kill you, if you're lucky. All right, guys. Now, what you guys are gonna do is just drive over to the spot. Now, there is one way to figure out if you are glitched or not, and I didn't do it. Um, so, I mean, I did do it, but it, uh, it's not in the video right this second. It'll come up in a little bit. So basically what you do to check if you're glitched out is you're just going to open your interaction menu, go to inventory, I believe, and then request your, uh, your RC Bendito. So inventory, then you're gonna request your RC Bendito. Once you request your RC Bendito, all you're gonna do is press triangle to get out of the RC Bendito. Once you press triangle, if your character blinks, then you are glitched out and you are fine. Okay guys? Now, once you guys know that you guys are glitched, what you guys are gonna do is you guys are simply gonna go to the glitch spot. Basically the same glitch spot as we always go to. Um, we, we always go to this spot. Basically from here, if you know what to do, go and do it. Leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on post notifications and go on your little merry way. But if you guys do not know how to do this, then I am going to show you right now. So what you guys are going to do, I had cops on me, so that's why I got the cops off. Um, what you guys are going to do is you're going to basically request your MLC, okay? Now, once you request your MLC, the, the reason why I'm looking at this wall is so my MLC spawns behind me. Hey, okay, guys. Now, once the MLC spawns behind you, what you can do is go and get it and put it in uh, whatever place you want. Now, you do not have to move it. If you could see the blue circle, you don't have to move it. Usually, when it's in the area um, like it is right now, you don't have to move it. I don't know why I moved it. I just, I guess I felt like moving it. <laughs> so, you basically, uh, you know, if you're in a, uh, if you're in a YouTuber's lobby or tw or I don't, I don't even think Twitch does uh, does give cards to friends uh, live, but if they do, um, basically, if you're in a YouTuber lobby or or in a live stream and you're getting cards from people, it's probably gonna spawn very far away okay guys so if it spawns very far away just go get it and put it into a spot where you can actually see the blue circle okay guys now right here uh what i'm doing is i'm requesting my uh my elegy from in the back of my moc and then to rinse and repeat what you would do is if there's a car in the back of your moc all you would do would be call another car like call a car that you don't care about or call an elegy and bring it out and do the glitch with that and then the car that's inside your MLC will go to where wherever you call that elegy from all right guys so what I'm basically doing here is I'm just waiting for my friend but when my friend gets here what he's going to do is going to get into the car and he's going to simply press pause once he presses pause all I'm going to do is go up and press right on the d-pad if you guys are liking the video, leave a like, subscribe, turn on post notifications. I'd really appreciate it, guys. I'm trying to hit my goal to one, 1K subscribers. Also, thank you guys for for uh, for um, helping me hit 600 uh, subscribers. I really do appreciate it, guys. It's getting close. I'm getting closer and closer and closer to my goal. Um, I should have said that in the beginning of the video, but I didn't, unfortunately. Um, my brain's not all there most of the time so anyways guys 
like I said, what, what your friend's gonna do is gonna get in the car, he's gonna, you're gonna drive up to the back of the MLC, press right D-pad, and your friend should be kicked, you get out of the, back up the car, get out, and then you're gonna uh, do the Franklin thing a couple times. So hold down the D-pad, go up to Franklin, press circle, then you're gonna go to the blue circle, enter alone, and then after five to seven seconds, you're gonna hold down your D-pad, go up to Franklin, press circle, and you'll either be like, so you're basically just gonna fall through the map or you'll just spawn on the street, invisible, and you're just gonna get into the car. And that's how you do it, broskies. That's how you do it. Now you guys have the car. So, like I said before, to get another car, all you do to rinse and repeat is to go call an LG or a car that you don't care about from a different garage. And then once you do that, do the glitch with that. Just do the last few steps. You know, have your friend get into the car, pause, or have your friend pause, do all that bullshit. You know what I mean? So basically, all that, and then, um, and then when the when the car goes in, when you get into the car invisible, everything should be fine. Um, the car that was in the MLC will go to your garage, and you basically are all good. All right, guys. Appreciate you guys watching the video. If you guys have watched the video this far, leave a like, subscribe, comment, turn on post notifications. I'd really appreciate it if you guys haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys. Tell me pretty lights. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.